Good afternoon everybody, this is Blitz, and I'm here to show you how to enable AMD's Virtual Super Resolution on your computer if you have an applicable AMD graphics card. Now that includes, I think, pretty much anything, I want to say 7000 series and up, as long as it's a GCN architecture graphics processor. Okay, but this is really easy. Uh, we just go to our desktop, just right click to AMD Catalyst Control Center, and we'll go to our my digital flat panels option here, then to properties, and then right here is a little checkbox. Just check that and that will enable us to use virtual super resolution on our computer, regardless of what your resolution is of your actual monitor. Now I already have it checked, so it's already capable of doing this. So let's right click again, go to our screen resolution option. Now this monitor is a 1600 by 900 monitor, however, we now have 1920 by 1200 and 1920 by 1080 available for us to choose if we do so please. Now I will leave my desktop in 1600 by 900 but if I go to War Thunder for example here and if we go to our options actually it's right here what am I thinking we do see that all these resolutions are available to us now now I do like to run this game in 1080p because it allows the game to have more detail and just look overall more sharp. Now some of you are probably familiar with what's called super sampling. That's essentially the same thing as VSR. You're basically running whatever in a higher resolution and then it's being downscaled to fit your monitor so it looks cleaner and sharper. Now if you go to AMD's website you will find a page on virtual super resolution if you just google it and down here they tell you which GPUs support this as well as what resolutions you can run depending on the monitor you're using. That really comes down to your display, your target display and its timing. So really what it comes down to is your resolution as well as how fast it can uh, output frames. Now I have a 1600 by 900 monitor. That means pretty much the only real VSR mode it, it supports is 1920 by 1080p. Now it also looks like according to what Windows tells me it'll support 1920 by 1200. Um, but I would stick to 1080p if you're going to stick with the screen aspect ratio. But you can see here that depending on your screen and what resolution it's running at, you can run all these other resolutions instead. Now be very wary of the fact that VSR will put a dent in your frame rate because you're increasing the resolution the game renders at. So bear that in mind. Now of course, once again, you do need an AMD graphics card in order to use VSR. Uh, like I said, it's a lot like using super sampling, because essentially it is the same thing. It is just agnostic to the fact that most games do not have super sampling available. So this allows you to bypass that and actually make use of super sampling in the form of VSR. So thank you so much for watching. My name is Blitz, and I hope you enjoyed this video.